All right, everybody. Hey, it's Dee Snyder, and it's that time of year again. That's right. 2019, it is the 17th annual D. Snyder's Ride. 17, barely legal. I don't know why my mind goes that direction. Um, I was thinking actually riding-wise. September 29th at Lido Beach. September 29th, Lido Beach, 17th annual ride. Right? How many have been there for every ride? I have. All right, listen. There's a whole bunch of stuff to tell you about this year, so please bear with me. Um, my ride chair, Bill Blackford, and, you know, we're riding from Melissa's Wish Again, raising money for the caregivers of terminally ill, terminally ill patients. Such a great, such an important cause. People are starting to pick up on this all over the country, by the way. And um, so he says, I'm just going to send you a few bullet points. It looks like pages, but don't turn it off, please. I just want to let you know, rides at Lido Beach again this year. Okay, you got that much so far, okay? Discounted price for advanced pre-registration and paid passengers includes 25 bucks discounted price for the rider, 15 for the passenger. That's a savings of 40% for the rider and 66% for the passenger. I was told there would be no math. All right, first 300 riders registered get a free barely legal 17 ride patch. Who doesn't want the words barely legal on their vest? You know I do. Uh, and there's a dedicated express lane for pre-registered riders. Last year's ride, they just get better and better and better. Uh, if there were any problems you saw last year, believe me, they are being addressed. But the dedicated express lane for pre-registered riders is a must. If you pre-register, you get that. No waiting on line the day of the ride. Also, special parking at the front of the ride for pre-registrants, which is always a good thing because it's, it's like a rock concert leaving. You know what I'm talking about? Um, all you got to do is pull in, register at the booth, and pick up your ride packet. Okay, now that sounds, you don't have to register. You just have to check in with your name. They probably show your ID, you know. And then you pick up your ride package. You pull up to the front. You're all set. And all pre-registered riders will be entered in a lottery to win a pair of concert tickets each month, supplied by our fabulous partner, WBAB. Been there for all 17 years. Love you guys, WBAB, Long Island's radio station. And if you don't win the first month, you'll be automatically re-entered for a chance to win the following month. So every month we got a pair of tickets, and this thing is in September, so there's a few more pairs coming. The earlier you register, the greater your chances are of winning. All right, we got something new this year. Check it out. You can now pre-purchase your 2019 Barely Legal t-shirts. Long or short sleeve, ladies tank tops, got those two. Get the style and size you want and pick it up the day of the ride. This year's design is destined to be collectible. Um, I, I, it would be self-serving for me to say that. They say that, but certainly it's a, a unique design. Uh, I'll just give you, you know, it's, it's a barely legal theme. No, no, we don't have any underage women or on there. No, that's not what we do. We went with the bare riding barely legal, you know, bare minimum bike. All you just just so you get pulled over, the cops can't write you up for anything. Just enough to get by. That's the theme for the shirt. So you'll you'll get it when you see it. But you can pre-order your shirts this year. And once again, we'll be riding for Melissa's Wish. I mentioned that, okay? It's a 501c3 not-for-profit conceived and inspired by Bill Blackford, Black, Blackford's late daughter, Melissa, literally on her deathbed, okay? Melissa was a supporter of this ride, often rode with her father, Bill Blackford, and her mom, Fran. Um, the Blackford family has been involved with this ride by ride since it started 17 years ago. So, here you go. I'm getting chills right now just talking about this. You know, 17 years ago, we're riding for the March of Dimes, and Melissa's riding with us. And here we are riding in her memory 17 years later. Thank God I'm wearing glasses because I'm getting a little, a little clamped. Uh, Melissa lost a tough battle with cancer. In her final days, uh, her, she asked her parents if they were to do anything in her name because they please help the caregivers of those suffering a serious illness or injury. Here's this girl laying on her deathbed, right? And and her last wish is not for herself, but it's to help others. She look around and see what the families were putting out, what the families were losing besides a family member. They were sometimes losing their jobs, losing their homes. 
just paying for the medical bills. So for the past couple of years, we've been riding, raising money to help families. We've been raising more and more money. This is a great cause. It is inspired by someone who has moved on, and it was her, it was her wish. That's why we call it Melissa's Wish. We've got a dedicated team of volunteers at Melissa's Wish that have worked hard raising funds and helping caregivers and families struggling, struggling with unexpected illnesses. A number of these families will be joining us at this year's ride, which is always very cool. So I look forward to seeing you at this year's ride to help this great cause. You know where I'll be, front of the stage, like cheering the band on, meeting you guys, taking pictures and stuff, and then, you know, of course, riding, rocking. Um, and, oh, hey, you say you don't ride, no problem. Come on down to Lido Beach. Park your car at the Sands parking lot next door. Make a donation. Purchase some raffle tickets or merchandise and enjoy some great music. It's a great time. Beautiful bikes. It's amazing. Your kids will, like, wig out when they see all these motorcycles. It's, and there's some impressive ones, okay? So um, come down. It's just a great it's a great day. It's down by the beach. It's the end of the season. So it's going to be like the last days that you can actually just, the first days of fall, it's going to be the last days you go down to the beach. It's always warmer down there for some reason. It's awesome. And once again, Joe Rock and the All-Stars will be anchoring the show. Okay? You know, I'll be getting up there. Um, you know, Mark the Animal Mendoza will be there, of course. And I'm, I'm going to invite some other friends as well. So, you know, we may have some surprises for you musically as well. But please, okay, just to tell, remind you, okay, this is my 17th annual ride. And it's happening September 29th at Lido Beach. And the one thing you need to put on this sheet, go to D. Snyder's Ride. I don't know if it's .org or .com. I'm sure you put D. Snyder's Ride in there, it comes up. You know, it's the beauty. The internet's beautiful now. You just put a few words, uh, uh, D, you know, and also you get the, uh, the ride. Okay, please consider pre-registering. Please, if you don't ride, look. And if you think of saying the weather thing, come on. If, if you don't, if you wind up saying, you know what, I'm not going to go, you donated 25 bucks to a genuine charitable cause. And by genuine, I mean no one's taking any salaries. There's no money on the side. There's none of that stuff you, you hear about, these corporate organizations. This is personal. We're all from Long Island. This is, this is a charity, and, we, and the money we distribute goes to people on Long Island, okay, who need help. All right, so um, thank you for riding me in the past. Thank you for considering riding with me this year. I will see you there one way or the other, come hell or high water. I will be there on September 29th at Lido Beach for D. Snyder's 17th ride, Barely Legal. Yeah.